Hello everyone, welcome back. So, so in our previous video, actually we have completed this model evolution notebook uh, experiment. Okay, so in this video, actually let's convert this thing as our modular coding. Uh, so first of all, what I will do, uh, I will create one file inside components. Okay, so let me go to components. So here, let me create one file. So I will name this file as uh, evaluation. Okay, evalu evolution dot file. Okay. So before that, uh, what I need to do, I think you remember I need to first of all mention my entities. Okay, so let me mention the entity. So I'll just copy paste from here. So this is my entity. Yeah, so after entity, uh, I also need to mention my configuration. Okay, configuration manager. So I will open my configuration.py and I will copy the same thing. So I'll open my notebook. Yeah, so I'll copy this method. And here I need to mention this thing. Okay, and I also need to import this uh, configuration. Okay, uh, so let me import it. Okay, so it is not coming here because we haven't mentioned this thing inside our constructor. So I will open this entity constructor. And here I will also import the same evolution config. Okay, now if I open my uh, configuration, now it should be accessible. Okay, so now if I press enter, yeah, so everything is fine. Now let me see any error is there. Okay, see everything is fine. Uh, so instead of this thing, what I will do, I will uh, write the proper path here. Okay, because see this path is hard coded. Okay, so I need to write the proper path. So I have already. Uh, written this thing so let me just replace okay so now see instead of taking the hard hard code path okay so what i did i'm, I'm just uh, reading this from my configuration okay so that's it now let me also change my uh, config entity because these are the config entity is not required so let me uh, remove some of them so let me just uh, replace okay with my previous one so only this much of uh, con uh, co configuration is needed okay so i won't be taking that much of configuration so this much of configuration is fine okay completely fine for us now let me see everything is fine yeah now what i will do uh, i have already prepared my configuration now let me see uh, now let's write the components okay so i will open my evaluation first of all let's import some of the libraries okay then i also need my entity so i'll just write from cnn classifier dot entity okay i'll import my evaluation configuration then i also need my save json i think you remember so from cnn classifier dot utils okay then i will import my save json this thing because i also need to save it as json format okay now as you remember i will just copy paste the same class i created and i will mention it here that's it i also need to import the same thing inside my constructor of my components so let me mention it here so from cnn classifier dot components i think in evaluation i will import evaluation okay that's it now let me close now what i need to do uh finally i also need to mention my pipeline okay so for this i will come to my pipeline and here let me create uh, another stage i'll name it as stage uh, 04 underscore uh, i will name it as evaluation okay evaluation dot pi okay so i'll copy the same code from my previous uh, one And I'll open my stage uh, four. I'll paste it here. So instead of uh, preparing callbacks, I will import my evaluation. Okay, and uh, this should be uh, evaluation pipeline. Okay. So now here I need to mention the same. Uh, pipeline i mentioned here so let me copy 
So I'll remove these are the thing. Yeah. So I think everything is fine. Now let me write my main.py. So I'll open my main.py. So here, first of all, I will give one stage name. But before that, let me import this thing. Okay. So I'll write from CNN classifier dot pipeline stage four uh, evaluation import my evaluation pipeline. Okay. Now everything is fine. Now, first of all, I will do the login. Then after that, I will call my that object. So evaluation. Uh, let's name this variable as model evaluation. And inside that, I will store my uh, this thing, this class. Okay. So this is going to be my object. Now I will call my model evaluation dot main. Okay. So model underscore evaluation main. Yeah, so now I'll uh, close my login. Also, I will close my exception. Yeah, that's it. Now I think everything is uh, perfect. Now let's test our code, okay, whether everything is working fine or not. So, what I will do, uh, I will delete two files, okay, and one is like our scores dot uh, JSON. And another is like our artifacts, okay? Yeah. Now let me open my code and let me see whether if everything is working fine or not. Yeah, so I will open my terminal. Let me clear it first of all. I'll just write Python main.py. So guys, as you can see, it has started downloading my data. So in, inside artifacts, it is downloading the data. So let's wait. Okay, I will come back uh, whenever everything is done. See, guys, now it has started the training. Let's wait. So, guys, here if you see, it is giving one error. Uh, evolution dot file line number forty five uh, model is not defined. Let me see. Uh, okay, so here actually you can remove this cell because uh, previously we mentioned as class variable. Okay, now I'll remove this thing. Now let me see whether it is working or not. But again, I will remove this uh, artifacts. Okay, yeah. Now I will open my terminal and let me run. And now guys see training is done now it is uh, also doing the evolution okay see this is the evolution log and everything is complete okay now if i show you my artifacts see all this test has run successfully even this is my model now here if you see it has also generated my uh, score.json okay now if i open this one so this is my loss and accuracy okay so that means every stage is working perfectly okay so we have completed the project okay so entire like uh, pipeline we have completed our training pipeline entirely we have completed only uh, our prediction is left okay so in our next video actually we'll be writing this prediction stage okay uh, now see actually we are successfully uh, train our model okay all the pipeline we have mentioned data ingestion model preparation uh, like callbacks preparation okay everything is working fine now after training the model i also ne need to do the prediction okay so this kinds of prediction uh, like ui so this kinds of actually prediction pipeline i also need to create okay so from our next video actually we'll be writing this prediction pipeline uh, now what i will do i'll uh, commit these changes in our github so let me clear my terminal. I'll just write git add git commit evaluation done uh, git push no, 
yeah now if you want to see you can open this uh, url Uh, so yeah guys see everything is uh, committed successfully okay so yes guys this is all about from this video so thank you so much for watching this video and i will see you next time